This one now. Uh, oh. mm. This needs a cob, but I don't want ears on it. Oh, I don't think they even have a cob. Like, wow. Well, it doesn't look like they have the fly mask. I might have to get him another one. I don't think they have it. I just wanted like one of these, like without the ears. But they don't have it. Oh, they've got, oh, that's got ears on. Because his ears are so big, they don't fit. <laughs> <laughs> see, see, Rain has the opposite problem. Rain has like the tiniest <laughs> ears in the world, but Chucky has. Oh, oh, I bet he's got the ears. Do I risk it? If you try it, I find the ears are quite big on the Shire's ones. Do you think I can return it if it doesn't fit? Yeah, 100%. Maybe we'll try this. Because the flies do annoy his nose as well, and I can just cut them off if need be. <laughs> Little DIY project, so. These are really nice. Is that the new Twilight? Mm. Oh no, it's nice in the navy. That's really nice. Isn't it? But then I kind of feel like for me, there's really no point because I've got the navy Loire. Yeah, for the sake of what a grey pie thing. Yeah. As lovely as it is. I do love your navy one. It is really nice there. I don't like purple, but that's a nice shade. Yeah. Is that the new I, Sienna? I kind of prefer the musk though. Oh, that's I really re pretty. I really like the musk. Yeah. I like that. Uh, is that the new blue one? Yeah. That's nice. So but many the choices. polo bandages always look so lovely, but I like have no use for them. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Same. I'd love to be able to do it, and kind of don't agree with like bandaging them just for the sake of it. So I'd be a massive hypocrite to just buy them and put them on, but they do look pretty, and it is very tempting to be a hypocrite. <laughs> oh, I think I need more overreaches. Um, I'm just gonna get some plain black. Overreaches. He's, uh, he's about to rip his other ones. It's not bad. £20 for um, fellow boots. Not bad at all. I mean, obviously, I have a pair. So <laughs> it's about a month too late, but. Bridal time. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, so this is the Shire's Velocity. That's nice. That's nice. Oh, it's in a pop size as well. I like the like ergonomic headpiece on that. Yeah, it's quite nice, isn't it? Well, I don't really like the reins. They are bizarre. It's quite nice. And there was the Ooh. collegiate one as well. Oh, is that? Oh, wait, this. It's got Velcro. I think, I think it was this one. Oh, was please this? ask for the nose pads. Oh, I think they've taken them off. Oh. So that does have the fluff on it but you have to get it from customer service, I guess. Okay. Collegiate figure. I don't know if this was, no, this is 123 pounds. That's not the one I was looking <laughs> at. That's Just definitely out of budget. Is this? That's nice. Mm. Well, actually, it's really stiff leather. Mm. Oh, it might be this one I was looking at. So these are the options. Well, we've got the Shire's Velocity. I really like the Shire's Velocity though, because the uh, yeah, piece, it's quite nice and padded. I really like that one. Um, I don't really like the reins, but I have quite a few reins at home. Let's look at the other one. It's really nice soft leather as well. That's really nice. That is not fixing. Yeah, that leather looks so nice. And then this is the This one's quite stiff. I don't know if this one just looks I think not the, as nice. I think the Velocity looks more expensive than it is. Shy, as you know, is a good brand and like yeah. the leather is nice. I think I might just get this one. <laughs> so excited to see it on it. I do really like that. Yeah, I really like the fluffy nose piece as well. He's gonna look so smart. Is that the right size? Cobb. Yeah. I don't think he'll be a fool. No, he's, he's so small and delicate. Such a pea. Such a little pea head. Yeah, I really like that headpiece. Yay. Yeah. I'm happy with this. It looks really nice. Make sure it is cob. Yeah. Cob brackle. Perfect. Amazing. In the trolley. Yeah, that yeah, yeah, that's what I want to have a go at. I think I might get just two, do you think? Well, not just two, I mean, should I get them in general? <laughs> not the quantity. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, but maybe maybe black. Black is smart, but it looks like there's only one black one there. Yeah. Also, I think in an emergency, these are bright. Whereas yeah. in black, you might not see them. Save your horse's life. I would like to do that. <laughs> you do not have to tell me twice. But how does it work? So it snaps if the horses pull on it. I think I'm gonna give them a go. Just because then I know they're in the box as well. Hopefully they work. Prepare for winter. You're gonna need like meal one, meal two, meal three. Oh yeah, that's true. Ooh, hooks. Hooks. Which one are you? What are your hooks for? So I've got, I've already got a ring, but I'm going to put on my stable door for, to put my head collar and head collar and stuff okay. on it. Then I think I'm going to get a couple just to go in my storage to hang things off. Yeah. And then I want a couple in the tack room. Now I've got a few bridles. <laughs> All your bridles. <laughs> to hang those off of. Yeah. To keep it organised. I need stuff for my rugs, but I feel like these are quite small. And then I feel like these ones are really big. Oh my god, yeah, that's like th this is the choice. <laughs> <laughs> it's like one extreme. To yeah. Get a couple of these small ones. Only like one pound. Oh no, they go over. They go on the wall. Over the door. I'm gonna get two of these for rugs in winter. This one actually comes with screws. I don't have a never-ending supply of screws at home. <laughs> I really want to get a, a stable chain. Get one. Oh, this is a nice colour. Yeah, but I also really like these like ones. Those. Maybe I'll get this instead. Because I do feel like with chalky. 
<laughs> this isn't gonna last very long. Whereas this I, is a bit. I really more. like that. That's so smart. How much is it? <gasps> <laughs> 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 These look really nice. <laughs> I think I'm gonna treat myself to this today. I've wanted a stable like thing for so long. And I've been a bit unsure about these chains because I just don't think Chucky would respect it. Whereas I think something like this he would. So I'm gonna treat myself today to this. Oh, oh my gosh, it's stuck. Okay. In we go. I have pretty much everything. I just need to get the feed. Um, yeah. Successful trips so far. Are you really pretending you don't know which colour you're about to get? <laughs> Are we doing this? <laughs> well, it's all going to depend. What size is a medium? Oh, that is my size. They stocked it just for you. Um, it's not blue in a medium. What about the other blue on the other side? Oh, no, I don't like that. <laughs> oh, okay, sorry. <laughs> sorry, the wrong shade. It's not on brand. Okay, the grey is quite nice. The grey is nice. And I suppose that would still go with quite a lot. Okay. I think we can stretch the grey socks. Okay. As long as there's no judgments again. <laughs> Guys, go, go leave comments on all Ash's things saying her grey no. socks are disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, can you remember? Was it you who got these gloves and they were really cheap? Yeah. I can't believe how cheap they were. They were like £7 when I got them. They were so good. But they were the winter um, thermal ones. I really like the mask. That colour really suits you. Not for right now, though. Not for right now. Oh, is this the bridal? This is the competition one. Oh, no, this is the work one. Yeah, this is it. I do like the whole clip thing, but... It, it made me nervous that I entered a competition and they didn't allow them and then I didn't realise. Oh, it's so soft though. Yeah. It does look smart. I like the brown with that stitching. It's a shame the black doesn't have it. Yeah. The contrasting. I also am not buying it, so... <laughs> You're sounding like someone who's been convinced. <laughs> Those stirrups look nice. Oh, feel how soft these are. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh so flexible. Almost a bit too flexible, maybe. Oh, 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 that's I think this is the competition, the dressage one. That's cute. I just really like their headpieces with the branding there. I think that's so smart. Yeah. And I like, I really like the piping. You know what? I'm not a big fan of stitching, only because when you clean it, it makes me worry that it's going to get stained. Oh, and dirty because yeah. it's white. Mm. This is a really nice marching girl. Yeah. <laughs> We're just walking along. Oh, that is really I'm nice. I'm like a lot more impressed than I thought I'd be. Yeah, I am very, I'm hard that's, pleased with things like that's this. That's like an understated but glam brow band. I can see Jasper in that. Who's, oh yeah, who's Jasper? <laughs> I was thinking Jasper. Feel these reins. Mm, I don't like those. I but feel like I'm holding a snake. Like, I feel like the friction, yeah, or the chafe on that. The yeah. chafe. We're not a fan of chafe. <laughs> <laughs> okay, apparently the grey socks aren't good enough for Ash. So here we are. Those Ariat grey ones. Oh, you don't want grey. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot why we're here. Well, I suppose they're okay. They're to be under your boots. That's true. That's very true. Oh, I'd love a boot bag. I don't know who I think I am today spending my money. Like I haven't just bought a horse book trailer. I guess I'll just stick with it. You're gonna stick with that? It will be okay. It's a nice shade of grey, it's not too grey. Okay. Good. What have we got left? Feed. Feed. Onwards. So just got back to the yard and I've put my stable guard up. I love it, it looks so smart, look at that. I love it. So got the stable guard up um i'm gonna go get chucky in now and then we're gonna go for a ride which i'm gonna gopro for you guys so you can come for hopefully a little canter with us i'm gonna open my fly mask oh it's blue i thought it was gonna be black because of the photo but it's blue 
but oh well it'll do hopefully. oh my god wait this looks huge hopefully it fits them i'll try it on when i get them in i wonder where chucky will be probably right down the bottom maybe oh i can't see him there he is right down the bottom Hello. Good boy. Wanna come in and go for a ride? Those flies, I've got your new fly mask. Good boy. So um gonna go for a little ride. Ground's softened up a little bit, so hopefully get a few trots in, maybe a canter if the ground's okay, but I don't want to push it. Um hey. <laughs> yeah um got everything on crown corner not crown corner in gate stone although they didn't have any of the feed so i'll have to go to crown corner to get that but yeah successful morning so far hopefully go have a nice ride hey chuck you like it what do you think good boy <laughs> hell oh she looks so good good girl Oh, what a good girl. I feel like I'm a celebrity right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and your ears fit. Lovely. Good boy. Good boy. Please excuse all his marks. They're just... It looks, his skin just shows everything up. So Stand. Good boy. Stand. Good boy. Good boy. So yeah, we had a a nice successful trip to Ingate Stone. I'm really happy with my stable. Um, what's it called? What's the thing? Not a bar. What's it called? You guys know what I mean. Stable guard. Is it? I can't think. Um, yeah, I'm really happy with that. I've wanted one for so long, but I just, I was never um, like sure on the chains. Um, so I'm glad I got the fabric one. It looks so smart. And especially, so I've changed his routine round to him being out in the day and in the evening. So it just means like during the light evenings, I can have his door open, um, obviously whilst I'm at the yard and have that up and he just gets a bit more fresh air and a breeze through his stable especially when it's warm so yeah it just makes me feel a bit better about him being in for a bit longer in these days i decided to swap his routine over because he's been every day for the last couple of weeks he's come in with some kind of bite or kick and i'm just getting you know a bit frustrated with it um so i'm hoping by swapping his routine over the horses tend to be a lot quieter during the day um so i'm hoping it kind of there's less opportunity for them to be messing around um and i think it's just quite unlucky that chucky is very li like thin skinned and everything shows up so like whilst whoever he's playing with isn't coming in with it it's probably just because it's not as obvious maybe um so yeah i'm I've changed his routine over to see if it will help because um, we're going to come off 24 hour turnout soon anyway so I'm only doing it like slightly earlier and hoping it will reduce the amount of battle scars he comes in with because uh, the whole herd gets on really nicely like there's no obvious animosity between any of the horses I think there's just quite a few young horses and they play uh, maybe a bit too rough so yeah we're just trying to limit that because <laughs> i i always prefer my horses to be like in a herd i think it's a lot more natural for them um and i'm gonna like try keep that as long as i can with chucky but like if it continues and it's just kind of he's clearly coming off worse being in a herd then i might have to like reconsider things um 
but yeah we're gonna hopefully get on top of it figure it out and as well he'll be in a rug soon because i don't think it's anything vicious i think he'd, that his um injuries would be a lot worse if it was something vicious but yeah i think it's uh just playfulness and where his coloring shows up so obviously i think that's the issue so yeah We finally had a decent amount of rain as well. The ground already feels a bit better. Um, it's still like obviously not super soft. Like I probably wouldn't go cross country on it right now. But um, yeah, it's much better than it was. So I'm hoping we can fit some trots and maybe a canter in if the ground is still a bit soft. Good boy. Ooh, good boy. Hopefully there's no deer today. Let's go this way. Boy. Walk on. Boy, what are you looking at? Good boy. So as you guys will know, I've really been like prioritizing my flat work at the moment. Um, just mainly because like he was still growing and he went through like that really big growth spurt. Um, so I didn't really want to be pushing him to jump before his kind of body had all caught up with each other. Um, but his flat work has come on so nicely and he finally kind of feels ready um, to like, to get jumping, to get jumping fit, to build up those muscles. So um, yeah, whilst we've been prioritizing flat work for the last, I guess, year, um, I'm gonna, he's having September off as a holiday, as a break because he's worked really hard. And then come autumn, he's gonna get going again, gonna focus on his jumping, get him jumping fit and really crack on with that because that was kind of my main goal with him. I did want to like show jump him um, although he really loves cross country, so I might consider eventing him if I get my nerve back. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're going to focus on jumping. I'm going to hopefully try to get him to, oh my God, look at all those uh, guinea fowl or whatever they are. Good boy, what are they doing running? Um, hopefully get him to maybe a hunter trial in the autumn. Um, maybe do some more fun rides, although the last one did absolutely blow his mind. Um, and yeah, just go to jumping clinics regularly. Now we have the trailer, we can get to these things. So it's kind of perfect timing after his holiday to really be cracking on with his jumping. Cause I think he's ready. Like his confirmation is kind of evened out a bit. He was so bum high before and gangly. Um, but I think, I think he's ready physically and mentally. You're okay. We're all right. You're a good boy. It's quite nice, isn't it? Should we have a little trot? Just trotting. Good boy. Boy. Good boy. Steady. Oh, steady in case there's some you know what. Oh yeah, what is that thing? Watch this hole. Good boy. I think it's just something in the crop. Good boy. Good 
boy. Right, we're only trotting, okay? Because not having our first canter along here. I know you and your antics. We'll see how we go over trot first, okay? And trot on. Good boy. Good boy. No. Good boy. Good lads. Oh, and it's a hill, you got to trot up it. Good boy. Lovely trot. Steady. Steady. Oh yeah, look, it looks like a balloon or something. That's fun. Nice, good boy. Oh, I don't think I've done my girth up tight enough. <laughs> nice, so Chucky, don't you speak. Because I can literally feel myself balancing my saddle. Good boy. No. Good boy. Steady. Good boy, very nice. And oh. Good boy. Very good boy. Okay, trot on. Trotting. Okay, we're having we're having a poo stop. <laughs> Better? Need to lighten the load. Come on in. Come on in. Come on. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Um, Good boy. Good boy. Good boy, that was a lovely canter. Clever boy. You're a good boy. Good boy. Walk nicely. Good boy. Good boy. Chucky's favourite trick here is to pretend to spook so then he can canter up <laughs> this little hill, isn't it? 
And now we're power walking. You can walk because it's good for you, but you're not cantering because it's too hard here. It's too hard. Good boy. Nicely done, Chuck. Very good boy. Good boy. Very good boy. So he is washed off, he is in his bed, I've just given him his night hay and now I'm going to make his night dinners. I really wanted to start him on that feed this evening, um, but I'm going to have to go to the feed shop um, this week to get some of the pure feed. I'm really excited to try it though. I'm going to try, I did like a like consultation and they recommended the pure working, I think it was. So I'm going to try that. Um, yeah, I'm really excited to try him on it. So at the moment he's just having his cochra and his chaff um and then lots of hay to get him through the night but yeah he was such a good boy on our ride I was so happy with him we even had a really nice canter we haven't had a chance to have a canter in like two months on a hack just because of the ground like, I just don't like risking it but the ground was so nice because of, we had so much rain um so yeah I'm really pleased with him he did so good and it's been a successful day I got everything that I needed from uh, from Ingate Stone so yeah uh, it's been a good day. Let's make his dinner, um, get that to him, and then we're done for the evening. His copra is just soaking, and then an apple on top. He's already messed his bed up, so please don't judge this. He's already pulled all his hay out, don't judge this. And he's already put hay in his water, so don't judge that either. Um, I've hung his thing up here. I'm hoping that'll stay and be okay there for the evening, because. My storage is so far away that I don't want to have to like walk it around every time I open his door. Um, so I'm hoping this will stay there. It's like clipped up out of the way so he can't like get to it. Um, yeah, good boy. He's been a very good boy today. Enjoying that dinner. So that is us all done for the evening. Chucky's just finishing off his feed. Good boy. That is um, wet by the way, it's not sweat on him. How many of you guys thinking I leave my horses sweaty? Yeah, you good boy Chuck. Mwah. I love you. See you in the morning. Door's locked. Let me just, I have to do feed, water, hay. Good, door locked. Cool, cool. Right, let's take this stuff home. Thanks. Night, love you. Night, everyone. Um, yeah, I actually might put my things in my trailer. I'm gonna hang these up in my trailer and see what they look like. I um, thought I'd try them instead of a Baylor twine. I'm very much a Baylor twine kind of girl. But I thought we'd try something new. It's a bit dark in here. Up here. Oh my gosh, the doors are open. Right, where am I gonna put these for a start? That could stay open, that would be great. I'm gonna know how to get this off. Okay, direction for use attach to the ring on your stable wall, secure the connection, and push the size crazy with. If your horse pulls back or panics, it's designed to snap open at a certain stress point. Okay, 
so I think. How do I open it? Oh, okay, and it has different weight settings, but they put the sticker over the weight, so I can't read that. So, if you put it on the first hole, that's 50 kilograms. If you put it on the second, 75, and the third is 100. I don't know how much to do. How am I going to cut this? Oh, okay, so we have these like little rings down here. Can you see there? Let me see if I can do this. Can I multitask? Can you see what I'm doing? Maybe here? So it's just hard there, do you think? And then push that in. And then put this sleeve over it somehow. Oh, like this. Oh my gosh, it's just so difficult. Oh, okay. Oh, nice. Look how smart that looks. Perfect. Let's put the other one on. Nice. Cool. Let me show you guys properly. And here we go. And then looks a bit smarter, doesn't it? Then a bit of a dangling twine. Nice. My lovely cherry there. I love it. I have been taking it for um, some practice runs. And I'm getting, I'm getting a good feel for it. So soon, hopefully by the end of the month, because he's having September off, um, we'll be able to get him out in it and get out to a competition. So yeah, I think that is. Oh, they hit my head on my car. I think that is the end of today's vlog guys thank you so much for watching i hope you've enjoyed it um i'm gonna go home and get some dinner because i'm starving um but yeah thank you for watching and i'll see you guys in the next vlog bye